Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny Channel. Uh, in our last class, we uh, complete all the stuff. We have to do another stuff is, here we have a update part. We didn't complete it yet. So I have to do the update part, okay? So here, uh, we only we have an option uh, in products, only search only we have did. We have a, another button update, okay? So we, uh, how to update is, uh, uh, here let, let's run the program and show you so you it, it will be easy to understand for you all so I'm going to run sales okay, so here's product table so here if you enter the product ID relevant product uh, should be display here uh, so if the discount you will be able to update the discount and all okay so so we need a update button so how to do the task is go to the project form this is a form i'm going to call get another button from the palette drag it drag and drop over here this button i'm going to uh, put it as update this button i'm going to name it as update so select this one right click uh, event action action perform so here I am what I am going to do is here I have to remove it. The same code I just copy this one, paste over here. Here I am going to here is you have to another one more text field is a txt id. Okay, so write txt id dot get text get text. So this one should be the int id id equal integer dot passint so you have write here is write like this okay so id okay so you have write what is the thing here i'm going to write here is update which table we update which table i'm going to update the record products table so update uh, product products products not products products let me get these other columns okay first you have to set the p name this is a product name here product name sorry set we have a keyword set equal set set we have to p name equal question mark comma price equal question mark comma discount equal question this is a prepare statement i have got where id equal question mark this id okay so this id we are getting okay so uh, another things we have to write here is the same thing we have to do it here is only the id we have to we have to change this id this id we have to put it, call it here record updated Right. That's the things you have to write. Here we are set int. That's it. That's the thing you have to do. Press run and check. Click here. I want to update this discount. Search. I am going to update as discount percentage. I am going to put it as five. So five percentage. I am going to give the discount as five percentage. Or ten percent. I am going to give the discount as ten percentage. Click updated. Record updated. Now let's see how the sales going on. Go to the here sales one here. Ten percent discount will be reduced. The discount amount you have to uh, include as ten percent. Let's click and again. I am going to update same thing. This time I'm going to no discount. Some some other uh, seasonal times no discount. You have to uh, include it. So update it. Now let's go and check the sales part. Here no discount. Three thousand three thousand will be displayed. Very simple. Uh, okay. I have done all the stuff well. Uh, if you have any doubt on this, you can ask me any time. So here first what I'm going to do is default the configuration of the project. I'm going to starting from there customize from blogging so right 
now let's run and check the products this is a project okay so run sales product we're starting from the right, admin one two three it's a password login so the, what is the password i am going to give what is the password do not match so password admin one two three okay one two three it's working okay it's working system is working fine if you have any doubt you can ask me anytime i have done all the stuff of the system i will upload the code in my tutorsfunny.com website uh, you can download and uh, use your project thank you for watching if you love my channel please subscribe me like me thank you thank you for your uh, thank you for watching